So hello YouTube, my name is Vlad and what I will be showing you today is actually two ways of mounting uh, SMBs and one is way faster than the other. And the reason I actually discovered this thing is because uh, I had problems with my NAS and uh, you know what, let me show you. So I'll be creating uh, in here folder called, uh, I don't know, old, whatever. And I will be mounting my uh, file share uh, the old way, well, the way I usually mounted it. So uh, sudo mount minus t which is tiffs uh, the IP address 1.99 and share 5 is the name of my share and slash home Vlad desktop and the folder is old so uh, I'll be mounting it here minus O add some options username equals Vlad I won't be adding the password option in here I need to add group ID, which is a string, a string uh, ID minus G, and uh, UID, UID, which is which equals string ID minus UID minus U, and I will be forcing it. So force GID, force UID, and this should be it, I believe. Yeah, password for share five. And let's see whether the old is mounted or not. Okay, it is actually do not need this folder. So let's close this thing. And now I will be showing you the new way you can mount and uh, it's called Geo. But first I need to uh, uh, create file called uh, credentials. So VI credentials, creds, I will creds. Uh, what you should do when creating this file, it should add a dot so it's so to make it you know hidden file and uh, place it somewhere safe slash home slash your username whatever so that other people cannot access it and this file is actually uh, quite simple so first thing is username the other one is a uh, work group and the, the third one is password now I won't be showing you that thing but I will be saving it so uh, where is my creds file oh it is uh, just a second M the creds uh, slash uh, uh, slash desktop so it is in here okay now uh, as you can see this thing is already mounted now I will be using the new uh, mount which is called geo go figure geo mount SMB dot 1.99 slash uh, share which is share 5 and I will be inputting my uh, credentials uh, bloody hell desktop desktop and creds now uh, as you can see this thing is created now as you can see basically that is uh, the uh, same uh, same uh, same amount now uh, <laughs> I'll, uh, I will be creating a file, a 10 gigabyte file. So truncate minus s 10 gigabytes and called uh, uh, file, super file, super file. There you have it. And I'm sorry, uh, ah, bloody hell. Um, uh, the super file slash desktop, it is in here. Uh, okay, so it should be 10 gigabytes. Uh, yeah, 10 gigabytes. So, you know what? Let's start a parallel copy. So this one is the... Uh, let's try it in here. And uh, this is the uh, newer one. And uh, let's try it in here. Copy and uh, paste. Oh, come on. Ah, sorry. I need to create... I'll paste it in this folder all the way. So this is 74 megabytes a second. And this one... wait for it this is super slow so this is actually 3.5 but you know what I'll actually close the new way just so that you can see that this one will not speed up that much it will be it will speed up up to 15 and it will stop so yeah fucking geo mount go figure and it is quite uh, quite easy to uh, to uh, well to use it so I hope this video helped in some way because it drove me insane uh, because I actually found that out, uh, I found, uh, because actually, you know, I figured this thing out because I read somewhere that uh, 
uh, some guy on some forum typed, yeah, manual mounts are so slow. And I was like, what? And actually, let me show you the third way that you can actually mount if you're using a uh, Linux uh, such as this one. So uh, it is actually quite easy. So unmount. Uh, I can actually close this thing. This thing is irrelevant. So uh, SMB and the IP address. And there you have it. And this is the uh, super fast one. So uh, I hope that this video helped in some way. If it did, consider subscribing. Uh, if it did not, well, you know, you'll probably click dislike. Don't do that. Mm. Anyway, uh, please consider subscribing, clicking you know, likes and whatnot. And if you do have any questions, please ask them down below. And uh, well, until the next time. Cheers. Bye-bye.